We are a group of people from different areas of the country, uh, Carolina and Pennsylvania, uh, Oklahoma, California, and Nebraska, those about the farthest. And we all went to school here at Emporia State, decided to stay here and raise a family. Once we did that, it's like none of us decided to go back because we had to have a job. We got a job. And so we stayed here. And so um, we started on a Memorial Day weekend uh, to where some of the other uh, families used to be there because I used to figure that I was, um, uh, oh, I can cook enough food for, you know, 40 people, you know. So I would have 40 people come over to my place and then not realizing that there were other families doing the same thing over at the park which was um, 9th Avenue Park at the time. And so we finally decided to go ahead and get there. And well, let's go, let's take all of our stuff over there. Let's all go there. And so here it was about maybe 125 people. Uh, so you're talking about like six different families. And um, we started the group uh, in 1999. Um, I came probably about a year later um, as being part of the group. And our mission for the group is um, to provide a safe environment, um, not only for the park is concerned, but also um, socially, educationally, and, 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 and then physically, uh, because those are the components that will provide for a nice community. different variations of characters that's in the group, which is people. Um, we have a um, variety of people that's in the group and um, everybody bring different ideas, want to do different things. But we found as though that if we can hold ourselves to um, education, um, social and economic, and then go with the um, the part of, of, of physical, um, because it, it allows the moms, seniors that's raising their grandkids, have a place to go at the park. Um, parents that's single parents that want to get out of the house and let the kids get, that's park, that's what that park is. And that is the involvement and the reason that it was evolved, you know, through the help of the city, uh, the community foundation, uh, the uh, 79 fund, um, Jones, um, Jones Trust, and then other members within the community that donate um, to us and through, you know, for us is that so that provides the scholarships as well as still providing things for the park. Um, match Day is important um, to me um, because I've developed a personal relationship uh, with um, folks involved in the Match Day itself. You do that. Once you have, um, you've been there three or four times, then you create a relationship. From that relationship, it allows you to reach out to different community persons, organizations, and then even those that, once you give them your idea of what the park is and what the group is doing, um, like for instance, um, we have scholarship. Um, then we still have a, the park project. Um, to where um, now, through a legacy through the Eastside Community Group, the foundation has allowed us to have a scholarship program and be funded. Also allow us to have a park project and somewhat funded. But we still you know, use donations or could use donations uh, from those that have rode by the park and enjoyed the park themselves.